Hello everyone. As you might have seen recently, NGROK that was free previously changed their pricing plan and limited the use of free tier. But I have a totally free and open source solution that I will show you how to use today. Before starting, I'd like to thank Thony from Discord that contributed a lot to our notebook and community since the start. Step 1. Open the new notebook that I've linked in the description. You will see new lines of code in the step 4. Simply launch the first cell that will install ZRock on the SageMaker environment. Then to verify it has been installed correctly, just launch the cell with ZRock version. For step 2. We will need to open the terminal to activate the ZRock setup. First, don't forget to copy the first line of command. Simply open a new tab, click on Terminal, and paste the first line. Afterwards, simply write ZRock invite. It will prompt you to write an email address twice. It's very important as you will receive the account creation for security by mail. Open your mailbox. If you don't see the text, it's probably in white. You just need to click on Create an Account. At this step, it will ask you to input a password to have access to your dashboard at any point. Now, the most important part, you will prompt it with a token. Please make sure to not share it with anybody, or they will have access to all your tunnel. In case you have leaked it, like me, simply go to your account and you can reset your token here. Finally, on to step four. Paste your token inside the cell shown on the screen. Don't forget to add the right syntax here. If it says you already have an enabled environment, you can continue with the launcher. However, if you restarted a new runtime, you need to install the first line of command. Then enable with enable your token. The registration and account is only to be done once. All right, congratulations. You have now a fully open source and free tunnel. You can use now indefinitely your web UI and stable diffusion once again. Before clicking on the ZRock link, please let him install stable diffusion launching models. Once you see the models has been uploaded, you can open the link and access the web UI.